And President Joe Biden says U.S. forces will end their combat mission in Iraq by the end of this year, but will continue to train and advise the Iraqi military. The announcement came after Biden held talks with Iraqi Prime Minister Mustafa al-Qudimi at the White House. And there are currently 2,500 U.S. troops in Iraq helping local forces counter what remains of the Islamic State group. Numbers of U.S. troops are likely to stay the same, but the move is being seen as an attempt to help the Iraqi Prime Minister. And political parties aligned to Iran have demanded the withdrawal of all forces from the U.S.-led global coalition against IS. And despite the continuing threat posed by the Sunni jihadist group. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.